Welcome to another episode of DP Outdoors. Today we have the Magnum Research Revolver from BFR, chambered in 4570. We're going to be doing the complete takedown and cleaning of this firearm. Um, as far as the manual goes, they only suggest removing the cylinder, which is what I'm going to show you how to do today. Uh, we're going to clean it, re-put everything back in. Um, anything further than that, they suggest not doing it by yourself. So we are not going to cover that. Therefore, you guys don't ruin your firearms. Not saying you are incapable of doing it. Um, however, I'm not going to suggest you guys do something that the company doesn't suggest themselves. So without further ado, let's get into it. Alrighty, so I'm going to go to the general steps first and foremost. And then I'm just going to have a short video of me doing it. Putting it all back together. And hopefully you guys will be able to watch it and know how to go from there. So first we're going to take this little booger out like that. So now your cylinder has free, free rain. If you flip this over, there's a little pin here. It goes by a flathead screwdriver. It only takes about four or five turns. Release your pin, and then your cylinder will be able to just slide straight out. And we're going to go into reverse steps, putting it back in. You take your pin, and so close up, if you see that little notch right there, that's what this screw sits into once it's screwed in. So you're going to put it in that hole. Which goes through your cylinder. Then you're going to want to hold this little pin down as you screw it in. That way it goes into that hole at notch. Yeah. Close it. And you're good to go. That's it. Alrighty, I'll a close up on the underside in front of the cylinders right by the barrel. Now you can see that there's this pin here with a flathead screwdriver. You will need to unturn screw that by about four turns, four or five turns. Um, and then we're going to pull this up along the barrel until the stop. And that is the whole pin that is actually holding in the entire cylinder. <laughs> 